Where do you find beauty? Is it in a picture? A poem? A song? Do you find beauty out in nature or maybe in the face of someone you love? Where do you draw inspiration from? Song lyrics? How about a marvelous sunset? Do you see God working in your life or in the lives of others? If you do, how so? Hello world, my name is David Dorn, and this is Preposterous, which is not your typical Bible study. And yes, this is a Bible study, but don't let that scare you away. In the movie The Dark Knight, which was the best of the three, the Joker tells Batman in that famous interrogation scene, you've changed things forever. Now, he was referring to the impact Batman had on the crime mentality of the city, but the same line works for what Jesus did on Easter. In our last episode, we talked about the resurrection which changed things forever. Jesus reversed the power of death. There is now this massive shift in the nature of things. Sure, there's entropy in the universe, but in the midst of a decaying world, we have this. He will wipe away every tear from their eyes. Death will be no more. There will be no mourning, crying, or pain anymore, for the former things have passed away. Then the one seated on the throne said, Look, I'm making all things new. I'm making all things new, Jesus says. What we see around us is being made new. It's being transformed into God's initial plan, a world without corruption. It's the kingdom of God breaking into our world. The band Gunger wrote a song with these lyrics. You make beautiful things. You make beautiful things out of the dust. You make beautiful things, you make beautiful things out of us. I believe the beauty we see is a glimpse of what God is creating, transforming and restoring. And when I say beauty, I'm not talking about hot or not. I'm referring to the sense of awe you get when you see something. The inspiration you feel when you witness the world. Was there beauty before Jesus died and rose again? Yes. But this, this is our new trajectory. He's making all things new. Beauty is most recognized through the transformation of something. You see the beauty of a sunny day after it's been gloomy for a week. You see the beauty in a person's smile when all you've seen is stress in their face for a while. Transformation highlights the beauty around us. So I asked you all, where do you see beauty? What inspires you? And where is God working in your life? Instead of telling us, I asked you to show us those things. So here it is. Here is a glimpse of God's handiwork. This is beauty as seen through your eyes. I just wanted to thank everybody who participated in our beauty campaign and made this video uh, possible. You guys have inspired me. I thank you all. God bless.
Thanks for watching. If you enjoy Preposterous, make sure you like this video and share it on Facebook with your friends. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to us here on YouTube and you can follow us on Facebook and Twitter. As always, if you have any questions for me, you can tweet me at I am Preposterous. And if you're a small group leader and would like to use Preposterous for your small group, you can sign up on our website at preposterousproject.com. God bless.